I'd rather see some pow. <laughs> And that brought to you by LS Nav. <laughs> <laughs> in LS swap vehicles. What do we got going on? Get her on the rundown. We got stock bottom M53, BTR stage 3 truck cam, rod bolts, rod bolts, other thing, a little pump, 243 heads. Chinese choo choo boy? Nah, it's an uh, American choo choo boy. Okay. Yeah. Repping America? Repping America. All right, I hear you. On what engine management? Uh, fuel tech. Fuel tech, all right. Fuel tech to the front. Fuel tech to the front. Well, Okay. Okay. Um, Dino Time just put it on E85. Just put it on E85. Straight out the pump. It still got a little bit of 110 in it, but you know it'll phase out. How many gallons of E85 did you put in there? Uh, about 10. So it's got enough ethanol. In. Yeah, you're fine. Probably only had a uh, gallon of 110. Yeah, you're fine. We're ready to send. You got you put new headlights in this thing too? Ah, yeah. Just fix the front end up a little bit. Oh, matter of fact, got a new bumper coming. Oh yeah, what happened? What happened to the splitter? Well, I had to get another one because, you know, what happened? on the last video of the car, there was none on there because I ran it over coming up. What'd you hit, like a raccoon or something? I don't know, a dead turtle, there's always something in the road. <laughs> Alright, but we just changed it at Wastegate Springs, making more boost, let's get it on the dyno. Oh god, you got a slick, oh. Ooh. 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 Okay, alright, Captain 26 inch tall tire on the Captain. rear. Racket racer over here with the white letters out. Hey, he said if it lives, you said if it lives, you're gonna let me make a pass this yeah. Thursday at Galat. Oh boy. Are we going to Galat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought we wasn't going to Galat. No, we're going to Galat Thursday. Okay, damn. So I gotta tell my wife not to come pick me up on Thursday. <laughs> to come pick you up on Thursday? Because yeah, I was gonna drive a car from my house to uh, bring up here to work on. Oh, I thought you meant you were gonna break it. No, no, no. I don't tell you about that. So <laughs> All right, so we're locked in. If it lives, we go to the track. You guys are going to see Stick Shift Dock back in action. Last time I slammed a gear was early 2012. Hey, this, I don't got the line lock on it because I got to get some lines for it. Oh, brother. No burnout for me then. <laughs> My feet don't move that fast. Can we get some of this in, in today's video? Hell yeah. We're going to have to fire it up and just, just hold it to the bottom. No, God no. That's not allowed inside. We first we gotta get F Phil's car on the dyno. Any guesses on horsepower? Five three on like eighteen pounds of ethanol. I say four nine. Wow, the disrespect towards Phil. The rooster on eighteen pounds, or the rooster on twenty five pounds made eight hundred horsepower. So I think it'll make. I think it'll make six nine. I think it'll make like six eighty. It is. It is. Hold on. It is a. Uh, it's a manual, so I think it, I'm changing mine to 720. Let's make 720 horsepower. Respectable. Any other guesses? Uh, 692. 671. I'll say 710. Seven, I said 720. All right. Vince is hey, 760. I, can I also make another one? Yeah. I bet we will see anything to lift the head or pushing water what is it done. I, I get, I'll lock in a Zaxby's meal that it will not push water on 18 pounds. Hey, well, I think we have a better chance of seeing a rod and or oil before we lift a head. <laughs> what are we going to see first? It push a head or it blow up the bottom end? Push head gasket. Ah, I hate myself. He said it's going to push a head gasket first. Kind of like f finding the end of a rainbow, but if you if you go to the end of the oil trail, you get you a fill. What, what we got going on here? A whole lot of. That won't be here. Ooh. Oof. You heard that, John? Dude, I hate this damn. It's the only thing I hate. This damn car. Are you doing the tuning, sir? Are you doing the driving? Is this gonna be like a fuel tech dyno video where we're gonna get you dressed up in a fire suit and you know, like make it all cinematic? 
And then we're gonna show 5,000 horsepower at the end. God, where do you look at that screensaver? Look at that frill map in there. First poll, Phil is on wastegate, which we think is around 17 pounds with little to no timing in it. Give me, don't leave me hanging. Uh, oh, three. Oh, yes, yeah, so we got yesterday's video on here. It sounded good when it came in. Feel good? Oh, shit. That soft and it made oh, damn, really? 570. It's super fat. And you got no timing in it. Yeah, no timing. Bump that timing up to about 22, 20, 22, 26. Somewhere in there. Oh. How many pounds? We gotta get a uh, torque. We gotta like get a torque from you. Sixteen. Yeah, I hooked up the torque pick or the tack pickup, so you know. Let's, see, uh, Do, let's go by RPM. That's the real test. More boost. More boost. More boost. So he might be out of turbo. Is a concern. Real tiny backside on like a, a mid 70 millimeter turbo. But they targeted more. So hopefully, more boost, more power, more better. Wondering what it made. How'd the tune, how'd the tune look though? Amateur hour. The tune was fine, but it's now it's targeting less boost. Hey, how did you not first time on a dyno? Phil, you're 58. How do you not know how to use a dyno? <laughs> Phil says he's gonna get out of this car and beat both y'all asses. Hey, I'm gonna be a dump master out here. <laughs> Five ninety. Huh? Yeah. Wes knows how to turn the boost up. He'll just connect the bottom and top of the wastegate together. Hey, hey, Chris, where's where's Phil's boost controller? Chris, get the boost controller. <laughs> Has Fuel Tech uses eBay boost controller. God, this, this doesn't make sense. What? It made 18 pounds of the street, but only 18 pounds of the 90. Different load. Yeah, true. But what? Uh, what's wrong with? Are you? Is the Fuel Tech not responding accordingly? It's, it's, I don't know. I, I might be out. I just if I put this manual control on there, I might just be out of back. Why don't we just? Pin it shut and see no, what it I mean, makes. If I put this manual, this there, I might be out of back out. I got a 110 on it. A 110 on on what size turbo? Uh, that's 475. So it's a 75. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. This is the. Does this come with fuel tech? Oh my god. Does the cylinder gate shut pop down right there. there? Put it. Put a turn in it. Chris, put some turn in it. I did that down. Put one ten. All right. Hit it. Hey, wait, 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 listen, hold on. 
I got a 5-3 sitting in the corner. Pin it shut. If it goes, just take the 5-3. Well, I'll give you a ride home tonight. Yeah. Well, I'll give you a ride home. Just, well, listen, you could have a brand new used. A brand new Gen 3? I got a Gen 4. What am I going to do with that? No. You got 29 pounds of oil pressure. It's a Gen 40. I got it shut. 30 pounds of oil pressure at night. It's at 140. It moves. That is a problem. 140 is not okay. Like, 90, it's got a, I mean, no wonder why it leaks oil. It probably pushes all the seals out of it. Pin it shut. I got you a backup sitting right over there. <laughs> yeah, this is no fun. <laughs> Wes? <laughs> Wait till Wes's car hits a dyno. We're not even going to ask him. We're just going to start doing things. We're like, what's going on? We're like, nothing. <laughs> All right, so what's different now? Now we're, we're trying to get more boost? All right. So it's just falling off yeah, boost. 15, and then it falls down 11. But hey, give me some. It sounds crispy. It sounds a lot better. What did it come in like? Does it seem like it comes in slow? Or is it just something used to like a converter, like where it just like loads it up? Remember what it made when we first put it on there? Five, seven. On the process. But it was it made 16 pounds of boost. Yeah, it made 16 And now you made 11 and it made 5. Alright right, guys, I'm out. Phil, great job. Look at that, daily on the dyno and then I'm going to drive it home. I like that. I like that. Ben, you're awesome as always. We'll see you guys tomorrow. No, another day. That's what we're on here. Nothing, not too crazy. Phil just making some pulls on it getting some uh, some tuning time, getting the car tuned up. And it's crazy because it's dropping boost and, and we did switch to that manual boost controller. So we did start at a lower boost setting, but it's almost making as much power as it did with five less pounds. So the tune is really getting dialed in and he's got like four to six degrees of timing in the bag that he doesn't even have in there. So super soft, super conservative, got it working good, really, made a ton of power just by fine tuning it and that's pretty awesome so um shout out to phil everyone go check check him out i'll put a link to his youtube channel down below but he's got a badass instagram and phil's here every day uh bus nass he does a lot of he, he takes in customers and does builds for them so if you guys are looking for a build phil is the guy to talk to hit him up on instagram and um he'll build you a car so he does hondas he does ls um his LS swap stuff is pretty badass, and he kills the Honda game. So go check out Phil. Other than that, that's going to be all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Comment and subscribe. We're going to be heading to the track tomorrow, so don't miss that. It is time to go racing again. We got some cars back in action. Brown Sugar's back up. The Cal will be up very shortly. Silverback's going to get a new turbo kit, and we're taking the Grand National out this weekend. So a lot of racing coming on the channel very, very soon. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like always, comment and subscribe. We'll see you guys in tomorrow's upload. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.